For Brattleboro Community Television and for WTSA News here on this Tuesday, August 23rd, my name is Ian Kelly. These are the stories we're following at this hour. Brattleboro police say they've identified the man who was shot and killed outside a Putney Road apartment on Friday evening. The identity is being withheld at this time pending notification of next of kin. The person who did the shooting was identified and interviewed by police. No arrest has been made at this point and no one is currently in custody. The investigation is active and ongoing. If anyone has information related to this incident, they are urged to contact the Brattleboro Police Department or contact the Brattleboro Police Department tip line at 802-251-8188. The Brattleboro Planning Commission has been actively working to understand the housing needs of our community. The town received a bylaw modernization grant from the Vermont Agency of Commerce and Community Development to support that ongoing work. Walking tours are scheduled for Monday, August 29th at 5 p.m. for a walk that will depart the municipal building and September 1st at 5 p.m. for a walk that will depart from the sidewalk in front of the Thompson House. The Vermont Health Department says a sample of mosquitoes collected in Alberg have tested positive for West Nile virus. This is the first positive pool of mosquitoes of the 2022 surveillance season. A pool is a group of up to 50 mosquitoes of the same species and location. There have been no human cases of West Nile virus yet this year. The last confirmed case was in 2021. New Hampshire State Primary takes place September 13th. Early ballots are available from town and city clerks from across the state. Mailed ballots must arrive by 5 p.m. on Election Day. Hand-delivered ballots must arrive by 5 p.m. the day before Election Day. Monday was the last first day of classes for students at three Vermont schools that will become Vermont State University. The new Vermont State University is a consolidation of three public institutions. The Unified University will welcome its inaugural class in the fall of 2023. Castleton University, Northern Vermont University, and Vermont Technical College are the schools that will become Vermont State University next year. The merger is in part an attempt to combine the school's finances after years of hardship. WTSA Sports, here comes the judge. Aaron Judge hit his 47th homer of the year, leading the Yankees past the Mets last night, 4-2. The teams play again this evening. Frankie Montes on the mound for New York, and that's the Yankees. First pitch tonight is at 7.05. The Red Sox had Monday off. They host Toronto tonight. Josh Winkowski on the mound for Boston. First pitch is at 7.10. For WTSA News and for Brattleboro Community Television on this Tuesday, August 23rd, have a safe and tremendous day, everybody. My name is Ian Kelly.